it's raining <laughs> not much but a little so I'm here and then I will go to Hemsedal Hallå, hallå! Oj! <laughs> hej, hej! Here we have Almstreit where Jeremy and Christian lives. It's so nice to be here again. We are going to Stirling. He is going to sh show me Stirling, how they live and have their sheep in the summer. That will be really interesting to see. And we are going on uh, uh, some rides uh, today so that Jeremy can show me something in the surrounding. So I will see how it will look. Uh, I have had a really good night. Slept uh, in my in my old bed, old bed that I had last time I was here. And um, yeah, that was the fourth night in Norway, I believe. They are so cute. So here is here this, is Stirling. This is the oldest building actually. Yeah, okay. But it's been modernized in the 1970s. Yeah. Um, there's no electricity or running water, but it's insulated and boiled yeah. in. Okay. Well, this cabin was built on the it was modeled on a traditional Stirl's house. Yeah. It was built in 1920, so it's a uh, well, it's around about 1920, so it's 100 years old. 100 years old, yes. And uh, the roof blew off or were like three years ago okay and we finally get got carpenters so, and so you haven't been used this building yeah we have <laughs> yeah okay so go and have a look yes yes it's chaos inside yeah i understand it's like a construction area yeah it is it, it is a construction uh, area <laughs> we have to keep an eye on the sheep so uh, yeah it's uh and we have to sort of like um, refurbish inside because it's a new roof on top. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, uh, there are so many stones that are really good for building. So I thought, oh, build a fireplace. Okay. So, um, so that fireplace is new, you can say. 25 years old. 
Yeah, that's... I built it 25 years ago. <laughs> it was new. <laughs> 25 years ago. It was new. That's new. Oh, yeah, the, yeah the that's new. It's 100 years old, so 25 yeah, years is pretty that's, old. That's, yeah, that's new. It's pretty new. Yeah, that's right. This, this one, we had a pipe going up here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, and that's not really legal. No. It's, it's so old and it's like cracks in it. Yeah. So we're going to get a modern one that just comes in here. Takes up much less space. Yeah. Put that one in there. Exact. So you you don't use the fire pit yeah, we do. in that. You use that also. That's especially in the um, August September when it's chilly outside. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It can be quite cold inside. Yeah. Um, but if you if you use that one, it gets too hot. Yeah. But if you use the fireplace, then it's, then it's just yeah. enough. And okay. Also, it's, it's really. Uh, Shishman's great grandfather's initials on okay, it. Okay. Ola Odd. Ordstreit. Yeah. They, they pronounced Odd with double A, A, A. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then it's the mark. Yeah. Rune is on the. Um, that goes back to the song. Yeah, the, 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 yeah, the one you have in your calendar. Yeah. 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 Primstaven. Yeah. That's right. Do you know what that is? Any, any guess what that is? They'll use that to mash up the potatoes. Okay. So that, that was very, very every day they would use that. Yeah, yeah, potato yeah. Potato cakes. Okay. And then they'll they'll uh, they'll make uh, like potato cakes on a on a big hot plate. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like so, left sir. Yeah, very similar to left sir. Yeah. Uh, That was the Stöller. Really nice to have seen it and be here. Really nice. Det funkar igen. Nej, ja, du kan åka före så. Ja, då filmar jag dig så. Now we are going to visit the place where it has been an old Sami uh, living area once back in a time. It's so interesting when you are able to ride with uh, people from the area because then you get to know things that you don't have the possibility to know Oopa, by yourself. Over there you can see a rain as well and the sun is shining also. So it's both raining and the sun is shining. And do you know what I see? We are 
going into the Norwegian Tet right now. I thought it was something familiar with this uh, place. <laughs> oh, that's cool. I believe I rode this uh, way from the opposite direction in 2022. So I came from the opposite direction from where we are riding right now. Ah, I know, I believe I know where we are. <laughs> ah. Jeremy is low on fuel, so we are going to go back to Alstveit and see if we can fill up with petrol in his bike. And uh, if the weather allows us, we will go to another place on the mountain as well. This is uh, Panorama Vejen and in 2022 I ride it from the opposite direction as I mentioned and not far from here there is a lake called Sörresyndin and there that was the place where I met up with Mikael and also this uh, place is really close to uh, the place where me and Jeremy were last year that called uh, Hildalen or Hydalen that's on the other side of a mountain here it's really close but you can't uh, go with a bike uh, between this place and Hydalen even though it's really close landscape look at this landscape my friends look at this landscapes So nice that we don't have this uh, car in front of us anymore. It smelled like I don't know an old tractor, old lorry. Oh. 
Men eh, personbil. Det finns inte motorcykel. I have stopped here at uh, Mountain Lake. Oh my toes. Uh, special plus yeah. I that the umbrella for the det er, det var, um, Når isen smelter for 10 000 år siden. Ja. Du kan prate engelsk? Yes, you can. Yes, you can. <laughs> It's a very special place this, because 10 000 years ago, when the ice was melting away from here, the first uh, people came Yeah, here. okay. They okay. following the, the reindeer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And um, so you, around this lake, you have some of the oldest uh, finds of Stone Age settlements. Okay. From, okay. from the from the time when they first started coming in here, what, yeah, yeah, yeah. nine thousand years ago. Yeah, 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 yeah. And, and it's actually uh, one of the richest finds for all of Scandinavia for Stone Age settlements. Okay. Around this lake. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And in these mountains. Yeah. So it's pretty uh, unique. Yeah, very. Uh, often there'll be you, you find small, low stone walls just like a line of rocks or stones yeah to to uh, lead them to yeah, the so they, they think from from the ethnological and anthropological studies they've done of other indigenous peoples in alaska yeah, yeah. they have a very similar way of hunting yeah yeah, yeah. Uh, get them to go the whole flock to go towards the hunting pit yeah 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 and then not far from the plant hunting pits very often you have a it's a shooting blind. Okay. Uh, they call it bugarstel in, in the dialect. Here. Yeah, yeah. Which bugarstel means the, the 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 place where you have a use a bow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So um, it's like bow and arrow hunting. They would the hunter would hide behind there. Yeah, okay. And wait for the deer to be herded in or, or yeah, yeah, yeah. In, the, in that direction. Some would fall in the pits and some would be shot by by the bow and arrow. Yeah, yeah, yeah okay. And sometimes the, the stones go down into the lake and for long enough they didn't know why why a stone would go into a lake. Yeah. But you apparently there's a tradition in the inland Eskimo in, in um, Alaska where they have kayaks. Yeah. With uh, skin um, I think they're sheep skin or reindeer skin. Yeah. Around, stretched around a frame. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And they'll go out and harpoon the reindeer. Okay. So they drive, and reindeer are really, really good at swimming. Oh, okay. So yeah, okay. Yeah. They don't mind going into the water. No. But suddenly you've got people in skin in these canoes. Yeah. Skin canoes, and they go out and harpoon them. Okay. But you have to harpoon them because if you kill them, they'll sink. Yeah, yeah, of course. So you have to have this over and then. Oh. And you have the same kind of thing. So that that's kind of interesting that 
you have an indigenous culture who's hunting in the same way yeah that they did here for 9000 yeah. years ago yeah it's pretty cool yeah wow. it is a uh, massive rain weather coming in so i believe that we will we will go we will ride right into the rain and it looks like a, a wall of rain coming to us so yeah wish us good luck <laughs> this will be interesting